Hi, welcome back to The Farmer's Voice. This week we're in North Otago at the Aspiring Cow Company. We're going to be talking to Nicola Neal and she is a vet that has a passion for calf rearing. Hi Nicola, thanks for being part of The Farmer's Voice. Nicola, what's your role here? Uh, so we're 50-50 share at this farm and I also rear the calves and I'm a vet as well. And from being a vet, you saw a real need to help people raise calves successfully? Absolutely, yeah. Really efficient, robust systems that work in all sorts of weather and, and can produce really good calves. So, Nicola, what does it take? What, what sort of robust system does it take to raise good, healthy calves? I think uh, it comes down to doing the basics right every single day. Uh, it's not about fancy products. It's just about really good stockmanship and attention to detail. Using your eyes and, and uh, making sure that attention to detail? More is missed by not looking than not knowing. So if you don't actually look to see that there's a problem, you'll never find it. Yep. Are you finding there's been a real need for that information and are the farmers taking it on board? Yeah, uh, yeah. there's a lot of uh, systems that we can improve and some farms I'm going back to for the second or third year doing staff trainings and the uptake of information has been really impressive. They're really taking it on board. And keeping those calves successfully growing all the way through, but and, and getting rid of the losses out of the situation. Too. Yeah, you know, we don't want to lose animals. It's such a waste uh, just because of inattention or, or the wrong system. Yeah, we've got to make that work. Nicola, what are some of those improvements that you've found as your experience as a vet that you're now bringing into the farm environment? So uh, a couple of years ago we got involved in a large national trial looking at colostrum quality in calves. Mm -hmm. and. There were so many uh, calves that were getting out without enough colostrum, so we've made some massive changes to how we collect it, how we deliver it to the calf, the quality of it, and the improvements in those you know, are, are amazing, I think. A lot less losses, a lot better calves. And that's the end result, and that's what we're all looking for? That's what we're looking for, and, and you could spend the same amount of time to get a worse result by just not taking the attention to detail with getting that colostrum right. Yep. Something as simple as just colostrum? It's amazing, you know, it's a free resource that the cow produces uh, and I see it every day where we, we don't make the most of it by collecting it from the, the right cow, like choosing the right cow to chew, to um, fuck it and then getting it into calves early enough that they can actually absorb the antibody and then go on to be healthy. There you go, Nicola Neal, coming up with practical solutions for calf rearing. It's not as hard as it needs to be and in fact she does a great job. Get in touch with her on Facebook.